الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على خاتم الأنبياء أشرف المرسلين وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين أما بعد just recording this quick video just to first and foremost tell all the brothers and sisters out there making dua Jazakumullahu khairan love the 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 dua and the, and the appreciation I'm not able to get back to anybody right now it's too many messages so I'm just going to record this as a message Alhamdulillah thumma alhamdulillah I'm fine by the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala everything is fine we had an incident today as I was downtown San Diego and there was a guy in a truck that tried to yell uh, any racist, abusive stuff. And then they call us terrorists, they call us names, but they're, they're the ones that initiate. We go out to a park, we go out and give da'wah peacefully, we just share information about Islam. These people, they come out, they're unable to debate with us academically. We give them evidence from the Quran, from Sahih Ahadith, from their own scriptures, and they have no answer. So what do they do? They turn to this type of abuse, terrorism and violence. So he tried to uh, yell abusive things. I told him to come and face me. But as I was driving, he tried to tail me. And when I stopped at a gas station to put gas in my car, he parked up top. I went closer to him and I told him, if you have something to say, come say it to my face. When I saw him come out of the car, I recorded. And, and we have recording and I'm going to post it. We're going to clip it and show you the recording. I'm going to give you a warning. He uses very foul language, so if you have children, uh, be careful during that time. This is not language we as Muslims would ever use. In it, he tried to attack me physically. And you'll see the altercation. And, and even though I punched him and he was too cowardly to fight me like a man, he took a knife and he tried to cut me. Well, alhamdulillah, by the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, I'm fine. His attack did nothing to me. I went to the urgent care and alhamdulillah, I'm perfectly fine. There is no issue. We're not stopping anything. We're continuing our da'wah. We're going to continue with what we're doing. We're going to Utah this weekend, continuing to call towards Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If I'm in San Diego, I'm going out to the park. I don't need any security. I don't need anything else. I have Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And Allah will protect us. This person, he's not going to get away with it. Fucking terrorist, I dog. Gotcha, I got you. You want to talk that you, stuff? Fuck you, man. Fuck you. You and your Muslim you fucking wanna, bullshit, dog. You want to talk that you. stuff? Fuck you. I'm an infidel. What's up, motherfucker? You want to? Yeah. You know? You think I'm scared of you? you, think I'm scared of you? Huh? Inshallah, this person is gonna get caught. If he's watching, don't think you're gonna get away with this, right? We we have your face. You you're not hiding enough. We have your weapon that's been given to the police. A file a report has already been filed. The detectives are on the case. Just like the other person who tried to attack us at the park, you're going to get caught. And know this, that you're a coward. You're a coward. You're a coward. You attacked me, and then you ran from me. You had a weapon I didn't. Why'd you run? Stand and fight like a man. I'm standing there like my feet are planted on the pavement. You're running like a coward. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to put us on the haqq and keep us on the haqq. And Allah will protect us and we will use the means of the law that is in the land because Allah should not only be against us, it should work for us. Why is it that when we get called terrorists, why is it that they don't get called terrorists? Why is it that when this happens, David Wood, Apis, where, where are your videos now condemning this action? When, when somebody does this at Hyde Park to a non-Muslim, you guys make videos in a second. But Muslim blood doesn't matter to you. Your, your hypocrisy is going to be shown. Where are the news channels? And nobody wa wants to discuss this. Why? Because there's a double standard. But we're not going to accept it. My brothers and sisters in the world, alhamdulillah, they are with me. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is with me. We will continue our da'wah bidin Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala until Islam reaches every single home. Bismillah. Alladhi la yudur ma ismihi shay fil ard wa la fil sama wa huwa samiyu al-alim. We begin with the name of Allah. In, the, in whose name nothing can harm us on the earth or in the, in the skies and he sees and hears everything, he knows everything, he is the all-knowing. He is Samir, he hears everything, he is Alim, he knows everything. With this dua, when we say this in the morning, Allah subhanahu wa will protect us. I say this dua, I'm not afraid of anybody. I have tawakkul Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. We will continue the da'wah, we will continue doing what we're doing, nobody's going to stop us if I have breath in my lungs. If I have blood running in my veins, 
I'm going to continue doing what I'm doing. When I have no breath in my lungs, when I have no blood running through my veins, when I'm dead, I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to continue this da'wah upon the rest of the du'at where it never ends until the day of judgment. <laughs> كل السعائر بادية آمنت أن الآخرة لا بد يوما آتية كل الخلائق حاضرة كل السعائر بادية